Hi, I'm Liliana. Many of you know me and uh, I know many of you. And for who, uh, for all the ones who don't know me, I welcome you at my short video talking about interruptions at work. A lot of people say that the interruptions at work cause them a lot of grief, a lot of stress. And these are the effects of uh, interruptions. Why are we talking about them? Uh, we are talking about the interruptions because they are the cause of reduced productiv productivity, uh, they reduce your quality of work normally, they do reduce quality of my work and my life, they increase level, levels of stress and obviously, as I mentioned, lower quality of life. So I want to say on this occasion, in this short video, uh, that uh, there are good and bad interruptions. Maybe we didn't think about this before. And uh, people try to come up with all sorts of tips on how to get rid of interruptions, which, which is, of course, impossible. We can only manage them. But on this occasion, I want to uh, point out that there are also good interruptions. And the good interruptions are the ones that people um, call interactions. In fact, they see them in interactions. And they happen in instances when you are getting uh, crucial information or some content that is uh, pertaining to your current task, something that is important, and therefore this is an information that has a value or a lot of value. And it's coming at the right time when you are working on certain thing to which this uh, information uh, relates. What about uh, ne uh, bad interruptions? Okay, I'm sure you uh, all are meeting uh, much more uh, bad interruptions in your working day, and these interruptions are the ones of little value or no value at all. Also, we cannot say that they are all equally bad. In the next video, short video like this, minute, minute, one minute or two, we are going to talk about um, factors uh, that, you, that will de help you determine how bad the certain uh, or particular interruption is. So you are not going to worry um, that much about each interruption you meet during your working day. Although uh, some research indicated that 80% of interruptions that we meet or we receive during the day are in that category of little value or no value. So we are going to talk about this and offer solution. I'm going to offer a solution in one of my next videos. So in the next video I'm, explain, I'm going to explain how bad are bad interruptions, what does it depend on. And you please go to my blog, please or here, please do leave a comment. Share your best tip you have, you might have, or forward this uh, video or this link to someone that can benefit from this. You can, of course, you are welcome if you haven't already downloaded my free 56 pages ebook on managing interruptions for managers and busy professionals. Uh, I welcome you to download this uh, on my blog. Uh, you can see the address of my blog here, the domain, uh, nopanicmanagement.com.